I, I had a lump for a while. My, I had had it checked out a few years earlier and it was a cyst. And a couple years went by and I, when I went back to get it checked again, it was cancer. So I already knew that I didn't want to go through chemo or radiation. Patricia was adamant about not undergoing a mastectomy. She was also adamant about not undergoing any chemotherapy or taking any anti-estrogen medication. Dr. Guilfoyle was right from the beginning surprised with some of the things that I was saying, but she was willing to work with me and listen, and I was very thankful for that. Patricia is a very smart woman. She made informed decisions. She was very respectful in sitting down and listening to all of the options that I had recommended for her. And in turn, I listened to the um, options that she was interested in doing or not doing. After a couple of months back and forth with Dr. Guilfoyle, she finally did agree to uh, let me have a lumpectomy. The uh, surgical pathology did show that we removed the majority of the tumor. Um, there were some close edges for which I recommended that we return back to the operating room in order to uh, take a little bit more tissue. However, Patty did not wish to do that. I am doing great, actually. I'm in the best shape. This diet and therapy that I went through is ongoing. And now I'm exercising every day. I go to the gym, I come here hike or butt mountain bike, and that's my main, that's my plan. Uh, in my opinion, she is at a little bit higher risk for recurrence considering she did not undergo conventional therapy. Um, so I've been trying to keep a close eye on her with uh, breast exams as well as ultrasounds. I currently go with follow-up every three months with Dr. Guilfoyle. She's watching me very carefully and making sure that I, I remain healthy. You know, I think that the lesson that can be learned here um, is that with Patty, she came in with pretty firm beliefs about what she was and was not willing to do. But after uh, we had some long discussions, um, we did come up with a treatment plan that was effective and was also in concordance with her wishes. I would highly recommend Dr. Kara Guilfoyle. If you're not sure, do some research. Whatever it is you do, which, whatever route you go, you have to believe that this is for you and you feel comfortable with it, otherwise it's your, it won't work for you.